I'd like to start uh, by addressing what this, uh, this election is really about. It's about a man named Joe the Plumber. Senator Obama met recently at a campaign rally, even under your tax plan, <laughs> Senator. Joe the Plumber is going to pay higher taxes. Well, well, hold on. So well, that's, that's, uh, that's if, if this election is about Joe the Plumber, I guess that, I win. Well, let's, let, let's be clear for a moment. Let's, let's get the facts straight. I said under my tax plan, I will cut taxes for 95% of Americans. I would like to cut taxes, once again, for 95% of Americans. Okay? <laughs> if you make less than a quarter million a year, you will not see your taxes increase. Boring. <laughs> look, Boring. Look, We're not going to start talking know, about if, if I could, just, just, one, just one, more, one more point. Yeah, just, sure. yeah. I plan to cut taxes for 95% uh, of the American working family. Okay, so let's, let's get that straight. 95%, I'm going to cut taxes. Okay? If you make less than a quarter million dollars a year, yeah. you will not see a dime of your, your income taxes go up. Uh, not a dime. Tax, so let's, let's when just are we going to start clear. talking about Bill Ayers? <laughs> He's a washed up terrorist. It's associated with terrorists. Somehow the notion that I want to do away with health care is not true. Now look, if you have health care, hey, hey, you, you question? can keep it. Hey, hey, Obama. Hey, Obama, can I ask you a question? Go ahead. Yeah, how would you, uh, how would you compare me to President Bush? Uh, well, odd question, but well, I would say you guys are fairly similar. You have voted with him at least 90% of the time. Well, you know, if you wanted to run against President Bush, I guess you should have done it four years ago. <laughs> Booyah, sucker. <laughs> Debate over McCain the winner. <laughs> yes. Woo! <laughs> that was awesome. You were just like, what? And I was all like, man. Zing. That's going been... to be on the Today Show. All the morning shows are going to be running that clip. I bet. You must have been working hard on that one, right? No, it was just spontaneous, completely spontaneous. You know, it's unfortunate that the, um, the tone of, uh, of Senator Obama's campaign has been, it's been so negative. It's been so vicious. Wait, wait, so wait, 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 wait. V vicious. vicious. Um, at your terrible. vice presidential candidate's rally, people yelled, kill him and they called me a terrorist. One woman assumed that I was an Arab, and you said, no, he's an honorable man. What are you saying? Well, that, you know, that woman that assumed that, uh, that you were a terrorist, that's, she's a mother, and I will not stand here while you demean mothers and their right to call you a terrorist. I won't do it. And, uh, and furthermore, I've seen, I've seen worse things at your rallies. I've seen T-shirts, people wearing these T-shirts that, that uh, say McCant. And uh, McShane. Wait, 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 hold on, hold on. It's, it's, you're, you're that, is, that is unconscionable. No, that's, if, I, if, I could un for, if, if I could for a moment. Repudiate that t shirt. If Senator. Joe Biden is an expert on foreign policy, uh, I believe that his experience with foreign policy is unrivaled. Matter of fact, he's also a family man who has not forgotten uh, where he comes from. And if God forbid something happens to me, uh, I believe that he will make an excellent president. <laughs> well, you know, the problem with Joe Biden is that he wants to cut Iraq into three countries, which completely ignores the fact that uh, uh, we've won in Iraq. It's, it's a paradise where freedom uh, flows from the faucets and, uh, and children sleep on golden beds. So um, I don't know what he's thinking. I know that Sarah Palin, my running mate, is, is qualified to be president for the simple fact that uh, well, she has a child with, uh, with special, well, special I'm needs. Not, I'm not sure exactly how qualified no, she is. No, this kid's pretty special needs, right? I mean, he's, he's like a country. <laughs> I mean, I tell you, he's, a, he's a handful. And lastly, uh, if you choose me as your president, I promise that I will work tirelessly, day after day, to give the American people exactly uh, what they want. And that's change. This is ridiculous. That's right? change. This is, you this can is believe ridiculous. It. Well, here's what change means, all right? It, 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 Senator uh, government over here just wants to bring you bigger Obama. That all doesn't right? make My sense. prisoners. It's, uh, it's very simple. You just all called right? them my prisoners. He's so eloquent. You know, he uses, he uses all these fancy simply words speak the and, truth. And, and phrases. That's it. Uh, if you hates mothers. I, I, that's not true as well. We all just right? talked about that. He's just more words. He's using more words. Oh, look at me. I'm Mr. Well, I'm Mr. Harvard Law Review. I mean, what is this? Hey, what, what's that over there? Look over there. What is that? Over here. Am I actually, is this, am I being punked? It's not an exit. It's a closet.